Right, we're now filming the um, the hallway side of the wood panel above bedroom number two, the door at number two. This is uh, bedroom number two. Um, and again, as you can see, that is supposedly glossed to a professional standard. That is glossed. It's glossed all right, it's about, I'd hate to put, you know, well actually I wouldn't hate to put a measure on it. I'd love to see how thick they've actually put it on. There must be some kind of depth device that would do that. I'm pretty sure I can get one. Um, there is one that's used in the trade, some surveyors use it. And I have a friend who is a surveyor who's already condemned all the work in this, all the painting in this house. So no doubt he'll be doing a report if necessary. But we're now on to the architrave, which joins up with the woodwork and the frame of bedroom number three. But this, this is the woodwork at the uh, at the top of the door. This is. Let's see if I can get it in. I think I've lost it, there it is. That is the transom. That's the piece of wood that runs across the top of the door, part of the door frame. That, you'll see, it is not roughly sawn timber or anything else, that is gloss. That is what they've done. That is gloss. Put on so thickly that it's left the tree bark effect. Unbelievable. Bob Parker, Manjit Bogle, and Anushree Leehurst say this is an acceptable standard. Mm. This is an acceptable standard. That's why I'd hate to have them working on my house. I really would. If that's an acceptable standard to them, wow. Would you want them working in your house? I don't think I'd want them working in mine. Anyway, this is now the door. Just to prove once again, this is a new door. This is the hallway side uh, facial of the door of bedroom two. And again, I've had a little scrape there, just at the top of the door. And again, you can see no primer has been used. Yeah, so I thought, you know, give these guys a benefit of that. Let's not do what they've done and do an absolutely shoddy job. So, I'm kind of working, this is a gloss, this is a fascia of a door, a new door, that should have been primed, undercoated and then glossed. That is the thickness of the gloss they put on to try and cover the door in one coat, because guess what, down here, yeah, that's it, that's right. You can see that again, I've used a normal decorated scraper just to basically peel that off. And it wasn't that difficult. Uh, again, if there was primer on it, that would have soaked into the wood. You know, the, the undercoat would have adhered to that and then the gloss adheres to the undercoat. But these, these guys, no, they don't believe in priming and, and undercoating. No, 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 they don't believe in scratch or sandpaper. They just believe in throwing it on and seeing what they can get away with. And they must have got away with it because, you know, this has been decorated a little while, so they must have been paid. And they've been paid because three people have passed this as acceptable standard for work. And again, <laughs> sorry, but this is definitely not an acceptable standard to me. And I'd imagine that any, any decorator in the UK, England, Ireland, Scotland and Wales, would tell you the same. That is an absolute disgrace.
absolute disgrace. No snots, brush marks where they put it on so thick. Back to the fascia of the door. And as you again, you can see the tree bark effect all over the place. Let's swing the back round here. There you go. That's what the lady of the house is being told is an acceptable standard of work. And just to repeat, you're not looking at a moonscape. This is the fascia of a newly glossed door. I said newly glossed, which is correct. It is newly glossed. Uh, unfortunately, they didn't use any primer or any undercoat. They just used gloss. Uh, again, door handle there. Look, all up by the door handle, exactly the same. Absolutely disgusting. No attempt at all. So you can do a half decent job. Tree bark effect again. Snots, bits of grit, rubbish all over it. And again, you know, the door frame, not much better. I must admit that is a little better, but I know what they've done. I know they haven't undercoated it or rubbed it down. Uh, and this again continues all the way to the bottom of the door. Um, that's kind of the left hand side of the bed and door frame, which is on the hallway side. At this point, I'm not going to be doing the walls because the walls are exactly the same as every other video I've shown you. That's the walls. Today I'm doing the doors and the frames on the hallway side and I will be doing the walls uh, in the hallway just so that I've got photographic and video evidence of a job that was passed by three people um, and they've told me and they've told the person whose flat this is that that is an acceptable standard that is an acceptable standard of painting Jesus this firm Arts Heritage and Waits Construction they're never going to get a phone call off of me to get my house done or any of my friends I know that look at the state of it now, I believe if the CEO of Waits or, you know, someone a little bit higher than Bob and Mr. Manjit Bogle saw this, I don't think they'd be very happy. It's an absolute disgrace. Anyway, that's the uh, face of the door, hallway side, bedroom number two.